all right welcome back to another video so this is what i got from the young nails memorial day sale so i picked up the mission control gel paint so i'm going to be opening this up and doing a little unboxing if you haven't seen these gel paints before i also got the monomer this is my favorite monomer i have tried a few different other brands but I always go back to Young Nails. This is the best monitor. So I got the big size, the 32 ounce. I go back and forth between the 30, the 32 ounce. And for example, for example, these smaller ones that you can get from Amazon. Sometimes I don't order it on time. So I need to get the small one. So I just wait until this is almost running out and then I just get the bigger one when I'm more prepared so thankfully I was prepared this time and I picked up the larger bottle I also got the speed bubble gum which is one of their newer colors it is the 85 gram so I'm excited that I was able to pick up a nice size of this color I was kind of I didn't really know which color I wanted to get at first, but bubblegum was, it just had a special place in my heart. So I had to get this color. And last but not least is the protein bond. This is, if not the best bond, uh, it is an amazing, amazing product for uh, retention. A lot of my clients, their nails stay on for they could probably stay on longer than a month i have i haven't had somebody go on longer than a month not that i know of but you will for sure have nails that stay on for a month if you use the protein bond and if you're using it correctly so that is what i picked up from the sale that they had the memorial day sale so I am going to be trying out the Speed Bubble Gum and I'm going to be trying out the gel paint and I'm going to do a design. So I have my practice hand ready for application and I have my nail tips prepped and ready to go. I do have a video on how I prep my Red Iguana practice hand so if you have any questions about that or if you want to see that just check out that video uh, I did prep this hand off of the hand so if you want to see a video on how I'm trying to preserve the life of my red iguana hand I can definitely do that where I show you how to prep it off the hand because as you can see like she's starting to she's starting to get messed up so I just want to preserve her as long as I can. If you have any like tips or recommendations, definitely let me know. So I'm going to get started on the first nail. We're going to apply it and then I'm going to do the rest of the nails off camera and then I'm going to go in with the gel paint kit and I haven't really looked at that in yet so it's going to be kind of a surprise. So. Let's go ahead and get into the application. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and apply the Speed Bubble Gum. So I have a really small amount of liquid. Uh, hopefully that won't really interfere. But um, you can see it's still kind of covering my brush. And I'm going to kind of drain the whole thing, but very lightly. I do three bounces and wait for it to set just a moment. Go ahead and place it down and kind of let the beads start to form a little bit.
So I applied that. Okay. So now I'm going to apply the next bead. So you can see it sets pretty quickly. This is a powder that dries or sets in about 60 seconds. So you can see it's starting to set pretty quickly. So next I'm going to do the other bead, the next bead. I'm not getting nearly as much product as the first bead. And just setting it down nice and lightly. Just going in and creating a nice little bead that covers all the edges. Get it nice and even. And blend it into the nail. Okay, so what this is going to create is a nice little area that you are then going to fill in afterwards so we created we created this little um, kind of like slope going down and then we're going to fill in this little area so first I'm just going to continue to build the nail And on the cuticle area, you need a you don't need a lot, especially since we're just doing the one color. You know, there's nothing really fancy about this. Okay, so now I'm going to do my favorite bead, which is the blending bead. I had a client tell me, she was like, that what you just did, always do that to my nails. I was like, okay, I will. <sighs> so this just ensures that it's just a really nice blend. Alright, so this is the application of the speed bubble gum. I'm going to file them off camera and shape them off camera. But I just wanted to show you up close the application. I love this color. It is not super trans or it's not super opaque. It is a little bit more translucent. I'm not sure if that is kind of picking up on camera, but it is not uh, like type of like a full cover. So let's go ahead and take a look at these gel paints. Okay, so let's take a look at the rest of the colors. We have power. Power up. 